Hey everybody, welcome back to the show. I'm Molly Dewey with my new friend Ella and my old friend Rhiannon <laughs> from the Eagle County Animal Shelter. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm doing better. <laughs> <laughs> I love when you bring us furry friends to play with. And this little girl, she's so sweet. Yeah, she's great. She's oh. You wouldn't even know right now uh, that she's just only eight months old. So right. she, she but did a baby. Take her outside and she'll show you that puppiness for sure. Yes, <laughs> loves to play. I bet she's yeah. going to be so excited with all the snow coming She loves the snow, yeah. <laughs> oh, my girls like that too. Oh, it's so fun. Well, so tell us what's going on at the Eagle County Animal Shelter. We're just busy. You know, we're full with cats and dogs. So if you're looking for that new furry friend, we have what you're looking for, you know, for sure. I mean, if you're wanting an energetic girl like Ella or maybe a more laid back uh, dog or, or maybe a kitten, we have we have all of that. So. You really do. <laughs> yes. You have everything. And you do such a good job taking care of all of them and, and really getting them ready to go to their forever homes. Yes. It's not like, you know, I feel like you know, people aren't just walking in and sort of getting a dog or a cat where it's like, we don't know anything about this animal yeah. <laughs> or, you know, like you guys, you, you work with dogs like Ella, you were just saying you're taking her to training tonight yes, and, yes. <laughs> and they have usually all their shots and, mm -hmm. and all that stuff. Tell us a little more about that. Yeah. So Ella, she's already spayed. Um, she's vaccinated. She's microchipped. So she's ready to go. Um, and that's amazing because yeah. those are huge expenses. They are. You know, we want to send a dog home that doesn't need to, you know, immediately go to the vet and, you know, spend another $500. You know, we want one that's going to be ready for its family and yes. ready to enjoy Colorado. <laughs> yes, I know. This little mountain pup, she's ready. Yes. Yes, you are. Well, and so I also love the volunteer program yeah. you guys have at the shelter. Tell yeah, us about that. Yeah, we, we have uh, some great volunteers that come in, and uh, we utilize them a lot for doing dog walks, um, you know, socializing with our cats, because sometimes we just get so busy at the shelter um, that we don't get a chance to, to get these guys out for some good long walks. So our volunteers are really key in doing that. So. Yeah, and what's so nice about that, too, is if you're know, somebody out there who wishes that you had the bandwidth or the time, really, to adopt a dog like Ella, but you really just don't feel like you can commit to being a full-time mm -hmm. dog owner, volunteering is such a great way to get your puppy fit. Yes. <laughs> and to really help out such a fantastic organization. What do you see over there? Shake, shake, shake. Yes. You're looking for your forever home. She is. <laughs> yes. So if somebody sees Ella on the show today and wants to adopt her, how do they do that? Yeah, give us a call. You can um, uh, call us at 970-328-DOGS or just stop by our shelter. We're located in Eagle right past the fairgrounds. Uh, open 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Monday through Saturday. So, yeah, come down and meet her. She's She's got so much love to give. We really yes, do love her. <laughs> oh, she is so sweet, you guys. <laughs> Call Rhiannon or go visit the shelter. This girl is going to go fast. If our producer Mackenzie out front does not take her home yes. this morning. <laughs> well, thank you so much. Thank it's you. so great to have you on, Rhiannon. Thank you. And it's good to have you on too, Ella. All right, coming up, we're going to check in on that local weather forecast, so don't go away.